Today we've got the defect with Chimera, fusion deck of three characters, interesting. Hoarder, whenever you add a copy, add twice, so our deck is massive and terrible. And whenever you start a new room, lose one max HP, which means we get to pretty low health pretty fast. The five plated armor is nice though. We've got nine cards. Oh my god, this is not good. I didn't know what that meant until now, and now that I know what it means, I'm sad. So we can only travel like one or two paths because we have to try every single elite fight. Uh, that being the case, let's see. Well, um, it doesn't really matter because what we're trying to do is just get them both low. And we did that. So now all we have to do is attempt to kill them both. Uh, since we have one strike and one zap, we always kill them both. Ta-da! Alright, white noise, scrape. Uh, random powers upgrade us the most early, but I'm gonna go with scrape simply because I want to believe that we will manage to do something amazing. Uh, I need better cards real bad. I forgot they get tripled. I don't think I'm really that sad about that. Like, what's amusing about this is that, yes, we did just cycle our deck into the garbage, but the problem is that most of our cards are worse than what we had anyway. I choose to play the one from my class. That's right, Scrape is from my class, and so is that Defend. I don't need your pity. Wow. That's, uh... That's some garbage. I could play Storm and attempt to get powers, but I don't want to do that? Let's see. Not going to be able to defend entirely, but we'll lose the one max HP anyway, so that's okay. And I really wanted to get some damage in. As you may see. That's why, because when we get some hard damage in on him, we can get closer to actually murdering him. Leap. Leap's pretty good. You know, I really wanted, like, a bunch of zero-cost cards, but we're not getting any of them. So, that's... good. Um... I mean, I could try and RNGesus it. Yeah, let's do that. Ah, uh, we didn't get it. My RNGesus was 50-50 shot to kill him. Now, naturally, when we had a 50-50 shot to kill him, we didn't. Because, why would we? But, now that if we get a 50-50 shot on this dude, we will take damage, it will happen. So we're gonna use this block. Oh no, it didn't! Wow, I am flabbergasted. I expected us to hit this dude so this guy would deal more damage. Nice. Oh, one for you and one for you. Beam cell, do it. That's right. Upgrade a card. What would we like to upgrade? I can make zap free, which is not the best upgrade. However, it does mean that we have one more zero cost card. And right now, those scrapes will come in very handy if we can get them to work. Is there a benefit to waiting? There is a small benefit to waiting. Ha. Huh. Well, we have a pretty strong chance of this going very poorly for us. What I really needed was not to draw all of my zero-cost cards, but okay. 
Well, in any case. Aha! That's about the best I could manage. So. There are my zeros. See, what, what do we got here? Ooh. Both of those are good, but the fact that this costs zero this turn means I can do this. Boom. Not only do we block him out, but having a card in there which blocks for 11 is pretty good. So beam cell, because it's free. Then we need to use two of these, so I will do this and this and that. Nice. Haha, -ha, we managed to block him out for a turn. A feat that I did not think would happen. No, the scrape! Nice. You might see my plan now. The plan is basically play scrape, get lucky, win. Is that going to work? Maybe. Give me it! There it is. <laughs> Alright, come on. Initiate plan. Well, we missed on one of the scrapes, but it's okay, because we dealt him a bunch of damage, and hopefully I'll draw more scrapes. We did not. Alright, unfortunately we split him while he has 26 health, which is pretty bad. Yeah, we take a bunch of damage now. That's because your boy is extremely lucky. I.e., all I needed to draw was Scrape on a turn, which, you know, was before we drew our whole deck, and we would have been perfect. But unfortunately, we're not perfect, so... Neat! Now, I'm unfortunate in that I did not draw the uh, the other scrape, but that's okay. Steam Barrier. Now, there's a better card that we could get. It's called All for One, and if we get that card, we're golden. We are golden gods unto which all shall bow. However, if we don't get that, we're in a pretty pickle. Given that, you know... Oh, I don't know. We, uh, we don't do very much on the off turns. Okay, well, don't you worry. If I block for what? 12, 17. 17 plus 5 is 23. And it takes me three spells. Yep, there we go. That was the, the tipping point. I don't know what's left in our deck, but I hope it's a scrape. It was not. It was in fact not a scrape. It's okay though, because I can still kill him. That was a very good one. Rebound. Uh, yes. Maybe. Core Surge. I took Core Surge, because I wanted it, basically. It was not necessarily the best pick, but I wanted it. Alright, so... Uh, we can't drop cards from our deck, and cards which exhaust are pretty much just Core Surge right now. So this is probably not the best one. Heal? A Lantern. We're doing the Lantern. Not because we're necessarily going to spend all the energy, but because sometimes we do. So, you, still you, still you, um, next turn's gonna suck. If we get a number of things, we could be okay. If we don't get a number of things, we're gonna be died. Well, we're gonna take damage, which is bad.
distressing. I could do this and kill you. In which case, boom. Did you like it? Do you like the way my bacon smells? That's right, I said it. So now all we gotta do is draw a block every single turn. That's actually not necessarily true. However, I will continue to uh, stretch the truth just a touch because it is in our advantage to not have to spend the four-plated armor. Beam cell. This. 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 Go. Get him! Alright, so we didn't necessarily get him, but we have more shots next turn. Now, hopefully, our uh, mostly unplayable deck will have us get a card that we can use. Alright, great. So first off, this. Let me do this. Yeah, got him. I didn't want to play Steam Barrier on the very slim chance that we cycle through our deck again. All right. We did get him. That was interesting. Nice. We perfected and we didn't even have to spend that potion. Should we have? Probably. However, I did not. Give me all for one and cheap stiff. Thirteen. Hmm. I don't enjoy being weakened, so we're gonna do that. We've got a problem next turn where we gotta take care of this dude and take care of this dude. This guy could be annoying. Please block you or this one. That's fine. I don't care. Okay, so... I want this. Let's also do this. Excellent. Now, let's see. Do this. And that. Excellent. Nice. Perfect strike. I don't care if you can block each other. You just deal lots of damage. Beam cell. Bye. Ooh, yes. This. This. Let's see. This blocks you out, so I can do that to you. And we win. Sweeping beam, heat sinks, recursion. All of this is garbage. Smith up. What do we need? Of the many things that I wish to keep... I want Scrape, because sometimes you can just arbitrarily win the game. Well, not when you get this insanely lucky, which is another way of saying, wow, we didn't draw a single playable card. That, that was interesting. Um, so, how do we want to do this? Well, no, there was a card that could have helped us there, but we didn't get it, so... Should have done this first, but oh well. Cool. I had hoped to be able to keep the dex buff, but uh, oh well. Alright, so here's how we do. First off, I'm going to drink both of these potions. That has a neat side effect you'll find about later. Now, first off, we gain nine blocks, so we don't have to spend anything blocking. And second off, we got to keep that strength because I had artifact stacks. A nice little side effect that I knew about uh, from earlier. And so first off, make him vulnerable. Draw cards. That was awesome. Do this to you. Do that to you. Do this to you. Now the question is this one. Not because we have to, but because we could and it looked fun. Excellent. We are in good shape to be able to kill him. Although, I suppose I did not necessarily need to uh, 
Ooh, nice. I did not necessarily need to use the plated armor, so there's something to be considered there. Now, I don't think we would have taken damage, but because the burn comes into a play before our block does, I just didn't want to take the chance. So, beam cell and strike. Seek, because we could not find the best card. No, we're still looking for cards. That's the problem. I mean, this isn't great, but... Yep, just go Steam Barrier. If I get all for one, we're gods. If we don't get all for one, this deck is probably going to flounder. So, we always run through a shop, which is fine. Just a matter of really where we want to go. I mean, I could avoid the shop if I wanted to. But I don't want to. So, I will do this path. Hello, annoying creatures all. It doesn't matter if you attack me or not, so... Alright, come on. We're not in great shape, unfortunately. Because both those guys buff, I did not have three attacks to drop any of them, so... Nido. Is there a card in my deck that would be nice to have? Go for the eyes, actually. Pretty good. So we'll knock you down. Zap is free. Just do that. Okay. So we block him out. Good. Uh, next turn is going to be a little bit tricky. Alright, let's see. So only dealing five means we can auto block him out. Do this just to help us cycle through our deck more. Neat. Uh, I mean, beam cell, I guess, just because helps us push our advantage a little bit. Do that. Nice. All right, we block both of those guys out easily. Next turn's all blocks, which isn't great, but that's all right. There we go. Nice. And now all we gotta do is get to some cards where we can attack and we should be fine. I mean, to be fair, we've got a lot of steam barriers in there. The downside of which is very clear. The upside to which is sometimes you can play a lot of blocks for free. So. Let's see. Still no. Ouch. Hmm. Let's see what this gives us. Oh, garbage. Okay. Uh, you know what? With that kind of garbage, I say take a core surge. Why a core surge, you say? Because it means that next turn, when he plays something particularly obnoxious, we can just ignore it. So he'll attempt to curse us, but uh, we don't really care. Artifact. Nope. 
That's another good reason to have cards which are just like, yeah, no, I don't take debuffs, no. Now he'll weaken us, which is unfortunate. We didn't have another one in hand, but that's okay. So first off... Nice. Beam cell? Yes. I approve of beam cells. Alright, so hyper beam. Interesting. So claw definitely happens. I love the idea of this. The only question is whether we want to get a gremlin horn up in here. Nah, let's grab this. And this. And yep, we're good. Now, we don't have enough money to buy if we came upon it. And all for one. However, we're kind of developing a side plan. So first off... We're doing this to you specifically because it keeps you weakened for this turn and next turn. Boom. I should have done that in a different order. However, you live and learn. Well, we're going to take a bunch. Live and learn, I guess. I forgot that makes us frail. So first off, sure, one of those. Then we do this, and we're done. Ooh. Claw, zap, this card, hologram, what would I like? This one. Good to keep you weakened. And now we murder. Oh, that's entertaining. Uh, charge battery? Look, I think we're good on blocks right now. Like, we've got a decent amount of them, and, like, we're, we're trying to cycle through cards here. Not worth it. If we got that, uh, if we got the curse, the first three cards we drew would be some Terra Bad nonsense. Now, how do we do this? He hits for 18. However, boom! Did you like it? I did. Oh, dude, sick, nasty farts, bro. We're just doing that to make sure he's vulnerable next turn. Dude, that was sick confluence. That was the easiest that fight's ever been for me. All of that's still Garbo, though. What do we want to upgrade? Absolutely we do. Sweet. Okay, let's see. Leap, defend, defend. Aha! We managed to even block you out, you obnoxious creature. God, that is so satisfying. FDL. Sundial, neat. Hi, gents. Alright, no one's attacking. This does 26.
I accept these odds. All right, zap them, buddy. Yeah, we did it. Perfect. So, let's see. Beam cell. Beam cell. Uh, it's very unfortunate. But I can't really do much in the way of blocking right now. So there's good news and there's bad news. The good news is we only take two. The bad news is there may have been a way I don't take damage, but I didn't think of it. Ooh, scrape. That's correct. Most of my deck costs zero. I love a good scrape. So we draw like two-ish cards. Oh, there we go. So first off, let's see. Uh, claw, claw, this. And none, none of those do enough. So we have to hit you with everything. There we go, and then bash. And we block you for free. Well, the good news is, Oh, that's so satisfying every single time. Yes, I will take more FTLs, thank you. Why? Why, I, I dare say this is rather unfortunate. So... Uh... 20. That's enough. Alright. I don't think I necessarily needed to use the draw, but I was like, I have so much energy. We should probably do something with that. Let's see. Now let's just cut right to the chase. No! I forgot! No! Oh well. Well, that's unfortunate. The good news is... Well. <laughs> the good news is... We, uh... As it turns out... Have a lot of zero cost guys in here. Let's go with beam cell and hyper beam. I'm aware, I'm aware. It just doesn't matter right now. I'm trying to sort out so we get all zero cost hands because they're awesome. Well. Aha, my plan was flawless and had no accidents at all. None. All that's garbage. Getting some powers might not be a bad idea, but I didn't, you know, want them, so. Alright, let's see. No, the hyper beam! No! Um. Yeah, there's no way we get enough attacks off, right? That would be a, a terrible, terrible gamble to try and get enough attacks off. Where's the other claws? There we go. <laughs> Ooh, that's satisfying. 
Who boy is that satisfying? All right, you. Let's see. What do I need? In this case, I think it's just better off that we just try and cycle through as many cards as we can. All right, here we go. Oh, I should have, I should have just taken the artifact. Oops. Well. Aha, uh -huh. at least you only deal me one now. <laughs> so, hopefully, we can uh, murder this man. Hmm. Again, we only take one, but we're kind of running out of time here. I mean, I guess that also works, huh? Oh, yes. Now, here's the thing. We're at the point where we don't cycle through our deck. That's not really how this works. So... All we're looking to do is get rich. Echo form or machine learning? I like a good echo form. The best. Uh, what out of our deck could help us the most? I don't know. I guess an early claw, maybe. Yeah, I guess that'll work. So yeah, we're probably not going to be able to perfect this, but we'll give it a good old gander go, huh? Excuse-moi. Alright, let's see. Since it gets duels... I could play this to draw one card, which is cool. Perfect. All right, let's see. Hologram, I would like a claw. Nice. That gains me enough block, so I can just do that. Yeah. I'm going to take this opportunity to take these claws. There we go. Nice. Why that? Because if I stack up all the lovely claw nonsense, boom, we don't get any debuffs, which makes this easier. Hmm. We have to make him vulnerable. Or, uh, weaken, rather. So. I couldn't double blast him. I wanted to, but we can't. Draw some free cards.
Unfortunately, not much else to do with our turn. He's just debuffing us on this turn, but unfortunately, the turn after this is gonna really, really suck. So, this is gonna hurt. Unfortunately, we had to burst him down past this point when we didn't have uh, Vulnerable. Oh, well, there goes that. Okay. Do this before we forget. So that's nice. Um, so there's no way we block him out. So we'll just do this. We blocked a surprisingly large amount. Sometimes it's quite nice to have Echo Form. Seek machine learning? I want more Seeks. But I think machine learning is the play because we just run out of cards. This is not good. No. No. I guess we get infinite potions now. Alright, I need a shop, and this is a double elite, triple elite, followed by a shop. Done, let's go. We're gonna try and go for some question marks because they could be the fight at first floor boss again. Yeah! There we go. Now then. It is extremely fun to just play like a million zero cost cards over and over again so uh yeah if you get the chance it's it's really fun to do decks like these because you're just like do it 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 i win i would like a beam cell ftl go beam cell ftl core surge Skim? Yeah, let's take a skim. Nope, I intend to buy something with my gold. Alright, so this one might be a problem. So I need to get rid of you. Yeah, this could be a problem. The problem is, I need to kill both of them, but attacking them is eventually going to deal me a lot of damage. And so, my biggest hope is just to zap them to death, which is not great. Okay, and rather than doing anything else, including taking more damage, I will instead add two uh, additional card draws, which will help us out immensely. Right, let's see here. Okay. Ouch. So we'll take two, but I'm going to say worth because I can just go like, thank God, this fight's going to end sometime this century.
Uh, nope, still no. We gotta go left if we wanna go for the double. Alright, if we get a seek, we gotta go... Oh, core surge. Excellent. This. Core surge. Skim. Can't do that. In case you're wondering why we can't do that, we can't do that because that will remove the artifact stack, the thing that's preventing us from getting constricted. Nice. Oh, nice. Do you see? Value. All right, so unfortunately, we do have to just block, I think. I messed up. Oh, well. Well, we're going to take a bundle, so might as well just do this. All right. Health generally does not matter. Hologram. Grab this core surge back. Not sure what we could have seek or we could have used to seek for, but. Ta da! Still can't constrict me. No. Boom. Got him. Hologram plus, I will take. Uh, liquid bronze sucks, so we won't. I accept. All for one! Don't mind me. Okay, so. Alright. Uh, how much we got in there? Just beam cell and FTL? So in this case, it's a number of things we could do, but I think the best shot that we have is just by taking these two guys. Because now we draw uh, eight cards a turn, and if we cycle hard enough, we'll get to all for one pretty fast, as opposed to pulling it now when it's pretty low powered. what I tell you? Now, let's see. I'm not sure. The problem is that because we draw so many cards, I was like, oh yeah, we gotta be able to dump the cards, so we need a lot of zeros. Yeah, I don't think we're gonna be able to block both these guys out, huh? Well, give it a go! That wasn't gonna work. Oh well. Yeah, I think grabbing all those accelerants maybe not as good an idea as I thought.
Well, we won. But not really by much. Fight a boss from Act 1, baby. I still think drawing two cards is a pretty good idea, so we will probably do that. Oh well. Here we go! We're gonna use these two potions on him. Well, that was truly unfortunate. So we block him out for the first turn. But, uh, yeah, all for ones are going away a little faster than I had rather hoped. Well, let's see. We do have an all for one left. So... We need a beam cell and a claw. Beam cell and a claw. A claw. Go for the eyes. This is good. Don't play this, we'll get too many cards. All right. Perfect. We blocked him out again. Yay! We got a million cards. Nope. Skill potion, huh? Who are we facing? Donu and Deka. Yeah. Alright, let's see. All right, we're gonna use this now because I think we're gonna need it. Oh boy. All for one. Claw. Uh, hold on, let's look for claw pluses first. Don't see any other ones. Since I don't see any other ones, I will accept this claw. Okay. Seek. There's another claw. Well, that went well. Uh, go for the eyes. Yeah, sure. Why not? We get one of them to start. I don't like the amount of attacking which is going on. I must tell you, it is quite rude. So one of you is down, we block you out, and now we get an extra draw. Good! So hopefully we will be prepared for next turn, when Mr. 43 in the back there starts hitting us real hard. Okay. Hologram. It's claw. Hmm. 
We did it! Now all we need is hologram or all for one and we'll be good. You know, actually on second thought, we might just be good anyway. <laughs> I forgot how many potions we get. Uh, this is still better. Overclock. Duplicate a card in my deck. What card should we duplicate? There's so many good ones. What should we choose? That's right, boys. All for one. Well, this is unfortunate. Uh, one of those for you. So 21 is coming in. Guess I will do this, plus this, plus that. So now there's 18 coming in, which we do block, if barely. Ta-da! Let's hope that we get lucky. Not bad, not bad. Uh, what do we got in here? Could just go for damage, though. Um... Yeah. So, first off... Sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. They currently do twenty-two. So I will drink this now. Of the many things that I would like to do, I think still just pulling out the claws are the best idea. Here we go. I may not have needed to do what I did there, but oh well. Thankfully, the free block is quite nice. All for one and claw. Yay! As it turns out, Claw is kind of the star of that. <laughs> Speaking of which... Sure. Okay. Uh... Yes. Yes. No. All right. So we'll get one more potion off this fight and we'll go in fully potioned. You have the most health, therefore I hate you. There we go. Now... Uh, that guy's gonna come back more than likely. However, we've made it so that there's only two guys who can attack us next turn. Want to make sure that guy's weakened. This one. There we go. Nice. That bevy of claws is pretty good. 
I don't want a Toka card out of my deck. Are you kidding me? All I want is more Seek. Seek, my boy, and ye shall find death. Oh boy. There we go. So, first off, I think I will take the time to try to knock some of uh, the artifact stacks off. I don't really care about orbs. And we block them out. Okay. So, now... Now we try to work on the, you know, killing them thing. Let's see. All in? I think the answer is yes. Okay. Let's see. Last chance to deviate. I think the answer is no. I'm all in on this strat. If it works or if it doesn't. Nice. How far we want to push it? Pushed it too far. Oh well. Hopefully we can get to another all for one, that's for sure. There's one. Whee! Not even close, Donu or Deca. Not bad. 1355. From what I saw when I was last at that front board, that was decently high. That's right, boys! Top 10. That's not going to last too long, but uh, proof of concept. Your boy knows what he's doing. As long as he's not, you know, completely stupid or screwed too hard. Boom. 